Hello, David Diga Hernandez here. I'm joined by my beautiful wife, Jessica, and we have a message for all of our friends and ministry supporters. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Very well said, my dear. And we love you. We're praying for you. Thank you for your support all throughout this year. And we're looking for greater things next year. Now, Stephen Moctezuma is here with us. He's going to lead you in worship. And then we're going to come back and I'm going to give you a quick encouragement. Here is Stephen Moctezuma. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do And I can search for all eternity, Lord And find there is none like you There is none like you No one else can touch my heart like you do And I can search for all eternity, Lord And find there is none like you There is none like you And no one else can touch my heart like you do And I can search for all eternity, Lord And find there is none like you And I can search for all eternity, Lord and find there is none like you And I can search for all eternity, Lord And find there is none like you The birth of Jesus, when the Word became flesh, when the Creator stepped into the creation. We all know that Jesus, the Son of God, was a gift from the Father to humanity. But have you ever thought about this? The Son was also a gift from the Holy Spirit. In Luke chapter 1, beginning at verse number 30, the scripture says, Don't be afraid, Mary, the angel told her. For you have found favor with God. You will conceive and give birth to a son, and you will name him Jesus. He will be very great and will be called the Son of the Most High. The Lord God will give him the throne of his ancestor David, and he will reign over Israel forever. His kingdom will never end. Mary asked the angel, But how can this happen? I am a virgin. Verse 35. The angel replied, the Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. So the baby to be born will be holy, and he will be called the Son of God. You see, it was by the power of the Holy Spirit that Jesus was manifested as a human being. You see, the Holy Spirit presents Christ to us. He is the gift of the Father and the gift of the Holy Spirit. So be thankful in considering that Jesus came to this earth not only to cleanse you from unrighteousness, not only to die for your sins, but to give you life and life more abundantly. The Holy Spirit presents to us the Word. He presents to us the Son. And in the Son we find our peace, our joy, our strength, our love, our hope, and all things eternal. Thank God for the gift of Jesus. Thank the Holy Spirit for the gift of Jesus. As a quick encouragement I just wanted to give to you, uh, this video is being released on Christmas Day, 
in 2017, but if you watch this video thereafter, I know that that will still be an encouraging word to you. I want to turn things over now to Stephen Moctezuma, who has a special musical performance for you. I pray this blesses you. Remember to keep in mind the things of the Spirit and keep in mind that Jesus is Lord and that God sent His Son Jesus as a gift for all humanity. Here is Stephen Moctezuma. Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, help me win souls by spreading the gospel through events and media. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.